Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in. We normally do a lot of photography work, but we've recently been hired to do some video, and for this particular project, we're going to need to have a dolly. And we were finding a lot of difficulty finding the exact length we were looking for, so we decided to make our own. And over the next few minutes, we're going to show you how you guys can do the same on the cheap. Alright. Alright, so we're going to go over what you're going to need to make your dolly. First, you're going to need some nuts and bolts about 3 or 4 inches long, and varying, and varying widths. Something like... 3 eighths for you're actually you're actually attaching your pan head with, and one quarter for attaching your inline wheels. You can get about eight inline wheels for thirty dollars, depending on where you go, and you're going to need them with bearings. After that, we're going to use a length of one and a half inch PVC pipe for the actual dolly itself, and two lengths of two inch PVC pipe for the track. You're also going to need some wood which you can get pretty much anywhere if you're fast enough and it's totally free. After that, you're gonna need some drill bits and a drill. And uh, you can probably get some of these at your dad's house. Maybe your mom? Probably your dad. And if you need a hammer, you can use a Canon 1D. Okay, so to build this, you're gonna need to drill some holes in your PVC and your wood at the same width apart and put some nuts and bolts inside. This will be your track. For the dolly, you're going to need to do the same thing with a smaller piece of wood and the smaller lengths. You're going to have to cut it to your own custom length of PVC pipe. And this PVC pipe will be attached, will have wheels attached to it, and that's what's going to roll on the track. This is how your wheels are going to look like. This is a face view of this area of the pipe. You're going to want to have the bolt coming in through the top all the way through the pipe, and then attach your two inline wheels at places on all four corners of the dolly on some angles and they're going to roll on top of your other PVC pipe. And this is the final setup. You're going to have your dolly rolling on your track with your pan head or tripod head even and your camera on top. So we've just finished our dolly. The dolly just lifts off, and as you can see, is connected just via some wheels. It sits on top of these two other PVC pipes, which are bolted down to some tracks of wood. And to get it going, just give it a little push. And it rolls really nice on the PVC. That's that. The dolly comes off. PVC pipes, kind of get smaller, nice and easy to move around, and that's all there is to it. We're going to show you some test footage, and you guys can be the judge. And there it is. And about two hours later, we're no worse for wear. And about $65 in building expenses. Didn't even break the bank. See you next time.